Mishlei, Proverbs 30. The words of Argur, the son of Yachev, rather, Yache, even the prophecy. The man spoke unto Ithiel, even unto Ithiel and Ukal. Surely I am more brutish than any man, and have not the understanding of a man. I neither learned wisdom, nor have the knowledge of the holy. Who has ascended up into heaven, or descended? Who has gathered the wind in his fists? Who has bound the waters in a garment? Who has established all the ends of the earth? What is his name? And what is his son's name, if you can tell? Every word of Eloah is pure. He is a shield unto them that put their trust in him. Add not unto his words, lest he reprove you, and you be found a liar. Two things have I required of you. Deny me them not before I die. Remove far from me vanity and lies. Give me neither poverty nor riches. Feed me with food convenient for me, lest I be full and deny you, and say, Who is Yahweh? Or lest I be poor and steal, and take the name of my Elohim in vain. Accuse not a servant unto his master, lest he curse you, and you be found guilty. There is a generation that curses their father, and does not bless at their mother. There is a generation that are pure in their own eyes, and yet is not washed from their filthiness. There is a generation, oh, how lofty are their eyes, and their eyelids are lifted up. There is a generation whose teeth are as swords, and their jaw teeth as knives to devour the poor from off the earth and the needy from among men. The horse leech has two daughters crying, give, give. There are three things that are never satisfied. Yea, four things say not. It is enough. Sheol and the barren womb, the earth that is not filled with water, and the fire that says not, it is enough. The eye that mocks at his father and despises to obey his mother, the ravens of the valley shall pick it out, and the young eagles shall eat it. There be three things which are too wonderful for me, yea, four which I know not. The way of an eagle in the air, the way of a serpent upon a rock, the way of a ship in the midst of the sea, and the way of a man with a maid. Such is the way of an adulterous woman. She eats and wipes her mouth and says, I have done no wickedness. For three things the earth is disquieted, and for four which it cannot bear. For a servant when he reigns, and a fool when he is filled with meat. For an odious woman when she is married, and a handmaid that is heir to her mistress. There be four things which are little upon the earth, but they are exceeding wise. The ants are a people not strong, yet they prepare their meat in the summer. The conies are but a feeble folk, yet make they their houses in the rocks. The locusts have no king, yet go they forth, all of them, by bands. The spider takes hold with her hands, and is in king's palaces. There be three things which go well, yea, four, are comely in going a lion which is strongest among beasts, 
and turns not away for any. A greyhound, a he-goat also, and a king, against whom there is no rising up. If you have done foolishly in lifting up yourself, or if you have thought evil, lay your hand upon your mouth. Surely the churning of milk brings forth butter, and the wringing of the nose brings forth blood. So the forcing of wrath brings forth strife.